started in 1983 when I bought a case of futures of Chateau Lafitte Gros Shield. And I got back, I've been into it ever since, but really more seriously since 2000. I had wine refrigerators before, and I built in, in that house, my previous house, a cellar that held about 800 bottles. So my wife was an interior designer, and while the wine room was my project, she picked out the colors. Mm -hmm. And the black, it comes up around the windows and the rest of the house. So it just kind of naturally flows. And then once a year, we started this about six or seven years ago, my collection is so large, I keep waiting for special events, and so we decided we'd create a special event. So now we do a wine tasting in December every year, 50, 60 people. And we have a menu, and we'll open six or seven different wines, and some boutique California Napa's. Every once in a while, something special. So last December, we had, I had three bottles left of the original case of 83 of the Fugue Shield, so we put that in the tasting. I've always admired restaurants that had the, the wine cellars you could see in too. So when we built this house, it was easy to do that. It isn't practical if you don't do it with a new house. And so I was able to do that and we've gotten a lot of pleasure out of it. This one is a traditional cellar, but yet it has that modern feel because of the large windows and the racks that are in knotty alder with black stain. The windows have an automatic blackout shade inside the cellar and the white shades on the outside of the cellar so it's totally hidden from the dining room when they want it to be hidden. But when you roll up both of those shades you see a beautiful view of the wine cellar right in the dining area. We did this cellar using a Wine Guardian ducted self-contained cooling unit that sits in the attic and is ducted down through vents in the ceiling so you don't see any of it. The vents were painted to match the ceiling. They're almost invisible. You can see we have areas for case storage below, a display row, and individual bottles along the two walls. We have horizontal racking on the left as well as above the arch. It's just an absolutely beautiful cellar. The Barolo door is an eight foot door, full glass, solid wood, I believe we did this in a clear alder with a black stain and lacquer. This door is dual pane glass, it has weather stripping all the way around, an automatic door bottom, and it comes with the case molding, interior and exterior. This is one of our basic standard doors that we carry, and it's a favorite by many wine cellar owners. Because it has all that glass, for a wood door, it has the most glass of any other door that we carry.